pleasure to see. I want to see the Alliance map. I asked that I travel to London. What do you know of it? A wild city, one that Halfton Ragnarsson tried to claim for himself years ago. But it resists all attempts to be held. Hytham claims the city is overrun by a strange cult. The Order of the Ancients. He asked that I track them down and kill them. Doing so may help the honest people there, and earn us an ally in the process. In a city so chaotic, it is worth a try. Approach by the North Gate and start asking around. I will. Good. I await your return. Murdering dog!
Triple Gate of London. I beg patience, all. We'll have this rack cleaned up in no time. Keep it steady, huh? Bear our master, Ame. You'll be on your way shortly, huh? Something up a shepherd, aren't you? <laughs> it can feel that way, aye. Can I help you with something? Who governs this borough? I would like to speak with him, if I can. Ah, the governor Trigger. Good and fair day and come to London four years back. Trigger? Aye, most hours of the day you can find him at the old villa, <laughs> dealing with old manor and Avery. Stow! Avgos wants his cut of the summer harvest. Shit, Carl. <laughs> huh? What's the holdup? We are talking. Gentlemen, the farmers of Mercia have paid their burden already. If Avgos wants more, he can petition for it. Petition for it? Well, you can tell that old mud merchant. <laughs> And if he wants his apple, he can bob for it. Belongs to Master Ame, sir. Bob for it! That is filthy. Bob for it! Heaven, you fight like the devil stolen your bread. You give some hard knocks yourself. Road, be a good lad and prick the names of those that pay their food tax, will you? Right then. You've some dealings with Governor Trigger, is that it? I will have dealings with any who can deliver a fair friendship with my Raven clan. If that is you, then all the better. Ah, no. Trigger's your fellow. I'm the Shire Reeve of London's westerly half. I keep things ordered and fair. Shire Reeve is not a name that rides easy on the tongue. Reeve's my title, sorry. Stowe's my name, Stowe of Lunden. It is good to meet you, Reeve Stowe. London sits on sturdy shoulders. Uh, to be fair, I'm not the only Reeve. There are two of us now, and the governor to boot. We do our best in these times, wild as they are. Take me to your governor's, though. He sounds like a man worth knowing. Right then. Station field, flock shepherded, and off to Trigger we go. And what can I call you? Humbler of thugs? Dane Hammer? I am Avo of the Raven Clan. We have a settlement to the north, just off the River Neen. Well, I owe you a great debt, Avo. You're a worthy ally. So, this is London, a city built by giants. So they say. She's an old place, surly as they come. But there's a mystery here I quite adore. I was raised here, in fact. Learned the scriptures of Christ's apostles in Lundinwich, our Saxon borough just past the western walls. You're not a priest, are you? <laughs> no. No, no, I was raised by them. And for a penniless bastard, I turned out pretty well. A penniless bastard, and now London's fearless real. Well, it's Trigger who saw something in me. He judges not the circumstance of my birth. His two hands, left and right, are me and a Dane-born soldier, Erke. Erke is an orphan of the last Viking horde to put down in London for a season. Two or three years back now, it must have been. It's through Trigger I met Erke, and now we Reeves walk the city like parents looking after our children. A native son and an imported Dane. See, London's a city built of many pieces. Wait. Something's wrong. Iron on the air. 
this blood is fresh. These were good men. What's happened here? insult O oh Lord deliver these men with the light of thy countenance visitive and shines upon them you've no need for outsiders stow it's a private matter there's no cause to be leery Eivor had my back in a brawl at Cripplegate more thugs from the garrison mm. you must be a real broker to hold your own against those shit hugs it's time to fatter those men stow it can't go on like like this If this one had a head, you'd be calling him Trigger, yes? Your governor. God above, the man is dead. Some respect, please. We'll get along well, you and me. You must be Erke, London's second reeve. Erke Botelson, yes I am. Are you telling me this gut bucket called me second reeve? First, in the Eastborough. And the man I trust with my life. Stowe's never been a good judge of character. Erke, this is Eivor. He came to meet with Trigger, to seal the bonds of friendship with his clan. He would have welcomed you heartily. He was a trusting man. And I got him here. Have you found anything? I just arrived. The killers left a ladder on the body there. I'll have a look around. Trigger had men with him at all times. How could the killers get through? They must have been known to him. Well enough to get close without suspicion. <laughs> Good. This letter. Someone wanted us to see it. From Rome, when an order of heretics worshipped the relics of a time before Christ. Erke, this was the letter he told us about. Said it contained fearful news about London. It warns of three such mistresses. The trigger's desk. Ah, oh, yes. The old man had a wandering hand. And I... I didn't know. I didn't think. He didn't want you to. It was his secret to keep. Find anything. Besides, enough blood to repaint the city's faded bricks. No.
not envy this man's death. Hang on. There's something in his hand. This was not Trigger's seal? Nay, it looks Roman in origin. It must have been on a ladder he opened. It must have been significant to this guard for him to grasp it even in death. Mayhaps it's what got him killed. I think I have a clear idea of what happened here. Trigger was shot where he sat. Probably as he read the letter. One of his guards grabbed the seal and tried to escape. He didn't. A second killer found him first. He met his end at the noose lifted by the bigger man. A third attacker took his eyes, then came for Trigger's head. Symbolic, maybe. Headless leader, eyeless guards. The killers were without fear. This killer was a message. Their footprints leave together, three sets heading back to the courtyard. The letter mentions three heretics, named only by Manikas. The leech, the arrow, the compass. Signed by someone calling himself a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Poor fellow soldier. Odd name. Three names, three killers, as you said. Baldersack. It could be anyone in London. Who can we trust? Only the people in this room, I fear. Even that would be unwise, until we know more. The Arrow is described as a pugnacious Dane invader. That describes too many in London. The leech hails from Vesex. London is home to many of them as well. And the Compass, a Frankish captain. Less common, but no face comes to mind. What is this symbol here? I recognize that from the Mithraic Temple. I passed it on the way here. This temple is our only strong lead. I would like to see it. Our city is overrun with cowards. We may be next to fall if we don't resolve this sick fermentation of hate. I've told you, this city answers to blood and power. We should serve as such. I can't leave him like this. He's... I need to. We'll get the church to see to it, though. No. No, it should be me. I must ready him for judgment. I understand. Only get some air from time to time. It reeks in here. Shall we, Broga? Locals have caught a whiff of this fatted mess. The temple is yours to explore, Eivor. Should the Reeves change their minds, I will have to gut them and put a puppet at the top of London's throne. But Stowe seems a good man. I will trust his word.
Tools for a surgeon, finely crafted. Like we found in the villa. And there's a letter here, arranging payment to a blacksmith. <laughs> the compass holds sway over the others. He has ordered the arrow to recruit archers in a market to the west. Worth a visit. Messages between the leech and the compass. Healing, gutting. The leech is a strange one, but the compass calls the strikes. Shed in London's future. At least soon in it will feast. <laughs> the guards here are vigilant. It's worth knocking on a few doors, that's all I'm saying. 
Trigger wasn't killed because you want to plant a few trees and fix a few roofs in London. Looks less like a meal for crows in here. Eivor, you bring good findings, I hope? A few sheets of vellum, notes between members of a secret society. The Order of the Ancients, they are called. Order of the Ancients? Doesn't sound any bells in this head. What's the purpose? That would take some time to explain. But know this, that I am here to kill them. In London, it seems the compass is the head. The arrow and the leech are his hands. Pet names and secret orders. What a crock. We know anything we can act on. The compass is a mystery. He is mentioned often, but there is little to go on. Said he was a Frankish captain, did you? To find him, we'd have to mark the ships that came and went along the Thames. Captains are a transient sort. It may be he's far away, keeping quiet. That may be, but would he scream if we cut off his hands? Oh, you've a filthy mind for strategy. You kill the arrow and the leech, then sit back and wait. Let the compass come to us. has need of flesh. Been looking for thralls, though I cannot say why. We've found a number of dead down by the Keys lately, but not thralls alone. Some of the missing we find again in several places, cut to pieces. Good lord, Erke. Let us not waste any more time. We'll find the arrow and the leech. Killing both should drag the compass back into port. So, I will catch you at the Western Market. Count on it. And I'll make for the keys. There's another few bodies there to fish out of the muck. It could be the leech is back at work. God be with us, friends. Go in his name, and be protected by him. is heavily guarded. Eivor, welcome to the West Market. A lawman like you could set folks on edge in a square like this. Why not wear a cloak? Hide my face? Not a chance. It does the people good to see a lawman on the hunt. And once we've found the arrow, this order needs to know we'll be after the leech and the compass as well. We know shed about the arrow and recruits. I've heard whispers. Somewhere here, a man gives you a coin. And this coin grants you entry to a contest run by the arrow's men. Which man? I see too many here. He's good at blending in. I haven't spotted him yet today. I will sniff around. You stay back. Eivor! What was your impression of Erke? You suspect him of something? I don't know. Whoever killed Trigo was a close friend, and... It was Erke who found the body! I know Erke so well, and I can't bear to think he'd do something so vile. 
But then do not. Wait for proof before you condemn your friend. Ah, forgive me. My latest thoughts have been restless. I've been a reeve for so long. Fighting for God's justice. I shed my earthly attachments for his great plans. But, but you could not shed Erke and his friendship. No. No, I'm not sure I could. It is good to talk, unburden your soul. Clears the mind and lifts the weight off the chest. Yes, indeed. And thank you for listening. I should find one of these coins soon. Will you be around? I'll return to St. Paul's just down the road. Godspeed, Abel. You got the coins? Seen them running mom's house. <laughs> What's your business? Shooting or watching? You are looking for skilled archers, and now you have found one. This contest is private, invitation only. Your men are handing out these coins like they were on fire. Is this enough? It's enough to keep us talking, but I'll want to see how well you handle that bow before you go any further. Want a trial round to test your eye? I've had enough practice. Let us begin. A real fanatic you are. Get ready. It's a simple contest here. Hit all targets true before the sand runs down. Here's the new competitor, a Norse from the northern wilds of Mercia. And our current reigning champion, Seer. All right, take your mark. Hook set, arrows north. A cheat! It was a fair shot! Carry on! Eivor leads to victory! That's deadly aim you have. Best I've seen for some time. Well shot! You have earned your place at the Arrow's side today. He'll be eager to meet you. Hold yourself to the Imperial Arch and speak with our man, Hussa. Recite the phrase. May the Father of Understanding guide us, and he'll know it's you. Huh? Arrow is making his speech at the Imperial Arch. On your way now! Are you Husa? Yeah. And who's asking? May the Father of Understanding guide us. And may the Mother of Wisdom give us strength. 
You're to stand just there. Look your best when the arrow comes forth and keep still. Friends, brethren, good people of London, we have had a hard week. Cowardly invaders stole into our governor's home and robbed him of his life. Trigger, my friend, my leader, slaughtered like a dog! It's a hard thing to raise the rats of a city into warriors. Hook set! You raised no one. You only trapped them in their cowering fear. Draw strings! First wave fire! No. I gave these men order. I gave them purpose. I showed them their common enemy. Anchor strings! Second wave fire! I was arrow for their rage. Without a foe to consume, we devour ourselves. He speaks true. A man without an enemy defeats himself. Justify all you want. You're just a king killer and a coward. Mighty high horse. You'd do the same if you were me. Aim and fire! You're unharmed. Praise be to God. It will take more than a few lads with newly polished bows to fell me. The arrow was a boy. A man with a boy's brain called Avgus. Avgus? That can't be right. I could return with his head on a spear if you would like to see. No. You've no reason to lie. Yet Avgus, my old friend, had no cause to murder. He saw Lunden as a kiln of rage. ...to harden the softness of its younger men. Perhaps I ignored in him what I hoped not to see. Ambition. Greed. Anger. From one man such hatred is easy to spot. But from many, it is a fog that fills the room. Power. 
Men will claw for it and cling to it at the cost of everything. Very true. And it is cold comfort, but glory has the taste of your family's blood. With Avgo's gone, I will turn my attention to the leech. Herkes should be down at the keys. He'll be waiting for you. If the compass should emerge, we will let you know. Then I'll be at St. Paul's Church, waiting for the good word. Take care, Broga. Venite odoremus et ada talata merum, eritis et fidem, dus et vos interam et promisa, in tua erit anima domina. Is this the leech's work? Yeah. New corpses every day. How can you be sure? Their eyes are scooped out. Black, empty caverns. Same as Trigger's gods. Must be hundreds of people passing by here each day. Anyone see them dumped? It's the riverbank, Vinner. Every crooked dealing in this city goes through here. Stowe has seen the same. It is not only the ducks. How is that sparrow hut? I worry for him. Soft, but unsullied. He helped me find Avgos, and that is enough. Avgos? I had a hunch or two about that arse blister. Should have acted. Any hunches about the leech you want to share? Erke! Tell me it wasn't her! It wasn't your daughter, dear Keda. Take a breath. Oh, thank Freya. I have such a fear I will find her down here. She works errands for a smith who sends her to these docks. Most times at night. I cannot stand it. What is your daughter's name, Gida? She's Regna. 
Named for my grandmother. Born with the same eyes. One green, one blue. A beautiful name. I haven't seen her in two days, and feared the worst. In London, you must always fear the worst. What sort of job did she have? Ran errands and the like. She would make a delivery, trade it for hack silver, and scurry back to her smithy. Do you know the name of the man? Name. But I wish I did. I would box his ears and harvest his nuts. Anything else you remember? I had a neighbor once tell me she saw Regna, lingering for a time under the London Bridge. Worried me sick hearing that. That is a good place to start. Thank you, Gila. A shady smith, a missing child. It's a lead with some weight. London Bridge after sundown. It's worth a look. Good. I'll hang about here and keep things calm. And Eivor, don't drop your guard around these ducks. Do I look like one who could? What's that song? I know it from somewhere. Show me. Just follow him, see where this leads. Can't this clod walk any faster? Look soon in there. Careful now. Is this the place? Or... No, just meandering. Best not to draw attention here. Lynched. 
light a torch. Like she's some sort of witch. Better have a look. What's all this? Thank you. 
sign here. You got the purse I'm out. Huh? Who the fuck are you? I'm a friend, Doya. Your money is with your lad. What have you to do with him? I'm keeping him safe. Had a fear he was being followed. Tch, I knew he was soft. Not like my other girl. She was hard as hog's breath, that one. What happened to her? Fell ill a few days back. So I sent her to a good Sister Friedeswith. Healer in town. Sister Friedeswith? Got broken bones? A boil on your bum? Or too much birth blood? She'll mend you quick. She would need a broad set of tools for such work. She would, and she has it. Comes to me for all her wants, and I craft for her what she needs. Not anymore, you don't. If they see me, this will get messy. This is where the leech dissects her prey. Please, please. My aunt came here for her cough. She never... Zunin, guide me. My aunt came here for her cough. She never returned. It's been days. I must see her. Get out, and don't come around here again. Survey.
chances to fix your right arm. I don't want to die in here. I am what bound to better things. You're not going to die, my dear. Have patience. We'll patch you up. She's confined herself to her stall for so many days and nights. Off to some strange alchemy there. You don't imply the devil's work, I pray. The good sister speaks to God alone. We should all follow her example in our devotion to him. Gotta get out! Let me out! Please, come on. Let's get you back to your cot. Just in case. Nothing. Not a thing. One more, that's all. I'm nearly finished. That is enough. Oh, it's you. For all the dead we collect, dear sister, you and I are equals. Quite a charnel house. I I'd lost count of how many. I suppose I've been greedy in my research, but not for lack of care. The ancient ones. The Arbiters. They built us out of simple pieces. So easy to break. So difficult to mend. There must be an improvement. We should be stronger. Faster. Smarter. I could have fixed us. I could have made us better. We are blood and bone and spirit, Frida Swift. Perfect as we are. You've such beautiful eyes. Finish it. Would you?
A young girl. Her eyes have been removed. I have a feeling this is the missing Aretna. It is done. Ah! The leech is blared out. And did you catch a name? A nun. Name of Frida's with. What? The good sister? That can't be right. She was a saint. A healer and a... <laughs> God! That brick fits this week's wall of shit. You knew her? She saved me. Mended the broken leg. Thought I'd lose it. But not with Frida Swift. You wouldn't know it was ever broken. The sands will run backwards now. Without her, we'll return to balancing humors. All of that for this. Secrets of the human form. How she saved lives. And how she ended them. It might be the ravings of a madwoman. Not every problem has a clean solution. True. Very true. I've built my name selling the hard fix. I'll live with it. This was her fix. All her ideas and discoveries written here. Ill-gotten gains. I have a mind to burn that bloody tome. Is that the right call? Too many died for this book. It is not worth its weight in blood. You're right. It would be like plucking straw from shit. Too much bad with the good. Odin and Freya weigh the worth of our lives, not some cunt in a wimple. Aye, get rid of it then. And tell no one of this. If you need me, I'll be at St. Paul's searching for something on the compass. Thanks for all this, Broca.
should not be seen in this area. Some surly guests outside. Eivor, we were... Uh, we, we didn't see you enter. Have you stepped out today? There's a strange feeling brewing in the streets. I've heard the shouts. The deaths of Abgos and Frieswith have angered many. Let us hope the compass numbers among the offended. I don't doubt it. But are we ready for him? It is time to focus on the compass, gather all we know, and lay it out, plain as day. Aye. We let fly the feather dart, cut raven ink from a cowering quill. Now we wait, wolf tensed, for the master of the river rep to return and revenge his shaken warriors. Well, well, this one's got the gift of all in's meat. What is on your mind, Stowe? We know the Compass is a sailor, a captain from Francia. And he won't like hearing he's got a leak in his hull, so to speak. With the death of the leech and the arrow, you want to hit back. But we can't know how or when. Apart from this, the man's invisible. Coward, if you ask me. Burn in your hell, you bloody reeves! We're pinned in! Is there another way out? The tower! There's an open window they can't have reached! I'll go up. You find a way out. <coughs> Abel! Make for the steeple! Then you're on We've many years yet. Come on!
had a view of the city from the roof. There's a new flotilla in the harbor. A compass. Bastard. If we commandeered the Springwoods that Avgos built, we could rain a cloud of arrows on the invaders. I'd sooner take the flank and go around this army to the boats. If we cut the head off this beast, the Order's men will be easy to rout. I want those Springles on our side. I will follow you, Stone. Up on the ramparts. We'll redirect their fire. Whatever happens, this ends tonight. May God guide our swords and cover our backs. Don't be reckless, little boys. I'll see you when it's done, Erke. Count on it. Follow me to the ramparts, Abel! They'll have no chance! back on the cover.
Do you see? This is the compass, large enough to ford an ocean. Burning to ash what you cannot possess, that is a child's way out. with London. Boudicca was right to burn it to the ground. It's a brick and mortar shit house. So bright and beautiful set of flame. Will you rule over these cinders now? Yoke its people to your whims and needs? You do have power here. Power you have earned. I have finished my work in London. That is enough. 
London is only a beginning. My order reaches further than your tiny boats can take you. Never forget, Trigger, my old friend. A man at sea may have gold and glory. But he is always a slave to the churning tides. We are that tide. Surrender! Please! No more! No more! Must thank for our good fortune. How do I look? Half drowned and half burnt? Not half of either. And far better for the blood on your blade. The compass is dead. London is yours to wreck or rebuild. We will rebuild. We'll strengthen the walls, reunite families, and likely use less wood or stone. <laughs> Ill timed, Elke. I'd like a quiet moment to pray. We'll take it together. Until our next meeting, I trust you will heed my call if I should send for you. You came to London in search of a friend, Eivor. You found two. I, Broga. And you deserve this. A silver ring for your raven perch. It was Trigger's before he gifted it to me. I say you've earned the rights to wear it now. I'm touched, Erke. I will carry it with pride. Let's tell her the good news. <laughs> <laughs> 